Okay, this is my third try time to take on the champion. Oh man. I'm gonna like get destroyed. I don't know. I don't know. Oh man. Okay, okay, Cynthia. Spiritomb. Alright. I'm just gonna start off, because I know I'm faster, I'm just gonna use Taunt, because it has Embargo, and I don't want it to not let me use items, because that's annoying. I don't know. I don't know. If... My brothers are freaking out. Luckily, that didn't raise all stats. It did that last time. Twice in a row, and it was stupid. Um. Okay. Alright. I think I'm gonna switch into Blissey so I can use Toxic. Um. That might be a bad idea. I don't know. Hopefully it'll run out of all its silver wins. So This is what I'm going to try to do. I'm going to go for a Thunderbolt. And then she might think... And then, then she might switch into Garchomp. Because Thunderbolt doesn't affect it. Then I can use Charm. I don't know. Though. I'm just going to use an item right here. Probably going to use Embargo. Alright. be enough to bring it down to the point where Toxic will kill it. Okay. Alright, I right, gotta cross my fingers. <gasps> yes! Okay. That's good. That's really good. Um, that thing took way too long to beat, though. Okay. Lucario. Hmm. Okay. Earthquake, R Sphere, like Dragon Pulse and Shadow Ball, I think. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's what it knows. Um Okay. Don't know what to do. I'll go into bronze on. Maybe. No, I'll try to put it to sleep. And um It's going for our sphere. I wish it went for Earthquake. I don't know why it didn't. I mean, I levitate, but the game doesn't know that. Unless it cheats. I don't want to lose Bronze on. I know Blissey can live through an R sphere. 
her psychic. You won. Okay. Hopefully, it will go for an R sphere and I can go for charm. Oh, okay. If it went for earthquake, that might kill me because it's physical. And we'll see it's really bad defense. I wish I had, like, Captivate or something, because that would be really nice for just shutting things down. I'm going to try to use Thunderbolt, and then try to predict it to switch again into Garchomp. Because that thing's the worst. Alright, R-Sphere. I think I should be able to live this with, like, half of my HP, because Blissey's special defense and HP are so high. And yeah, that was really good, actually. You know, um, I can't sacrifice Blissey now. I need Blissey for the uh, her Milo tick because I I don't have like anything except for Blissey to take that out because um, yeah. You know, I'm, I think I'm going to sacrifice Drapion. I don't really need it for anything. Maybe I'll go for an Earthquake and I'll get lucky. Uh, okay, alright. That's good, that's good. I'm going to just set up some Toxic Spikes. Even though, if she brings in Roserade, it's going to, you know, uh, take them away. I don't care, because she might not send that in next. Okay, that's good. Charm really helped, it didn't do like very much at all. I would have poisoned Lucario, but it's steel type, so it can't be poisoned. I don't get how it's steel type, though, it's kind of dumb. Okay. Right. I only have one layer up now, which stinks. So. Maybe it'd be good if Roserade did come in because. I don't, I want the Milo tick badly poisoned, not like regular stupid poison. Maybe if, oh, yes. So glad it went for Earthquake. If it went for R Sphere, that would easily nip, knock me out, like, in two hits. Alright, Earthquake. I don't know if this will knock it out in one hit, but I think it'll do just enough, so she won't use a Florist Door, and then I can knock it out with another one. Okay, um, that looks to be about how much it did. Alright, R-Sphere, this, if it gets a critical hit, that's really bad, because it's definitely going to knock Torterra out. It's really powerful on Lucario, really nasty. Ooh, okay, that's good, I lived, I lived. Um, Alright, so that's your second Pokemon there. I thought for a second I was gonna live because like the bar kind of stopped for a second. I would have freaked out. Wow, I did a lot of switching around with that thing. But it's okay because I took it out. Alright, Milo Tick. This is okay. This is good. I'm glad she is switching into this thing. like like probably the reason I used Blissey in this game is for this stupid thing. It's so it is the worst. It's defenses. Special defense and HP are so so good. And since Blissey's a special wall, Milita can't do anything to it, pretty much. Alright, Aqua Ring. Now, I'm going to try to see if she wants to switch. I'm going to use Thunderbolt, and then I'm going to use Charm right after to predict um, her switching into Garchomp. Because that's what she's did in the past. And now she's going for Mirror Coat, because I would never have gone first. Alright. 
It's not gonna do too much because Blissey has a ton of HP. Blissey had Mirror Coat. And that would do a lot to my little town. Alright, right here I'm just gonna go for Charm. So if she switches into Guard Charm, then. Are you kidding me? She did that before, and that stinks. If she did that now, then that would have, like, my master plan would have been, like, in motion. I'm gonna need to use, a, like, a full restore soon. But I'm gonna go for another Thunderbolt. down to half. If she switched now, I would be so mad. I don't want to chance it. I really don't. No, wait. No, not uh, hyper potion. Max potion. Oh, man. If she switched out here, I would... Alright, good. Good. Alright. I think pretty soon she's gonna get in the zone where she uses a full restore. And I... Do not want that. But, alright, she's going for ice beam now. Won't do as much. Won't do as much. I guess there's not really much to talk about. Because it's just like so long of a battle, and all I can do is focus. Oh, man. I should use a full storm. And it. Oh. Kind of expect her to do that there, but uh, yeah. All right. <sighs> Darn it! <sighs> All right. All right. I think I'm just gonna switch in the hunch goes like that fodder. Maybe, I don't know, if, she, if you use Big Impact, that was stupid of you, okay. Alright, now, now I guess I can just go into Blissey I can use Charm to lower its, uh, lower its attack and stuff. Which is what I really want to do, because this thing is a powerhouse. It's like, it's, it is so good. It's 130 attack. It's, it's Uber Man. It is the best. I always like to use these things when I play through Pokemon Platinum. Yeah. Alright, I'm, I'm afraid Blissey's gonna die. So, um, I'm gonna switch into Gastrodon so I can use some Ice Beams. And hopefully kill it. And this thing has a citrus berry, so that stinks. Our earthquake is gonna do like probably a little bit less than half. Yeah, so I can just barely live another one. Like, barely. Um, so if I go for an ice beam, that'll bring her down to her citrus berry. Ooh, dragon rush. That could flinch me. I would stink. Okay, so Ice Beam will bring it down to its, um, to its Citrus Berry. Then, I wish Toxic activated, I mean the Poison activated before that. Because if it did, then it would just die right there. That would be the coolest thing. Alright. Alright. Alright, 
She's gonna heal, so I'm gonna heal her. Um, just in case she doesn't want to heal, because if she doesn't, then I'm screwed. This is like, like the hardest champion fight. Like, I don't know, for me, at least. I always have such a hard time with this game, because the levels are so much higher than mine always are. Like, I, and I never want to train, but, because, because training is stupid, and, I don't know. I always had such a hard time in Pokemon Heart Gold, because Lance had three stinking Dragonites, and I always died, and, like, one hit from, like, all their attacks. And if I wanted to win, I had to, like get super lucky and I had to retry it like so many times. Okay, I spin. Hmm. Alright. If I got a critical hit that'd be nice. <sighs> I thought for a second it did. If it froze that'd be cool too. Holy oh, sweet. Alright. Hmm. If he uses Brick Break, then I could live with one, but I'm gonna be on the safe side and not try to over predict things. Yeah, I'm really glad I wasn't being stupid. If this got a critical hit, then I'm doomed for life. Um, Alright, so now all I have to do is go for Ice Beam, and unless this crits me, I. I I beat this thing. Alright, sweet. Yes. Yes. Woohoo. Oh, yay, Bartom. That's usually her strongest Pokemon. My little tick is probably her most annoying to take down. Because that thing is just such, such a, a tank. It is the worst. I hate it. I hate it. Alright, um, Roserade. Only no special attacks. Uh, unfortunately, it's poison type, so I'm gonna have to, um, uh, yeah, that's, that's what happens. I'm going to have to, um, use an Aether, or, or you know, I'm just on Aether. I'll, I'll just use an elixir on uh, Blissey's moves. Cause, all right, extra sensory knows like extra sensory shadow ball, energy ball, and sludge bomb. Two moves it gets the same type of attack bonus from. As you can see, doesn't do like anything to Blissey though, cause Blissey's just awesome. And yeah, this thing's tough though. It has like, like. 125 special attack stat it is like it's really good and it's pretty fast. However, its its special defense is good, but it's very frail in physical defense. Uh, yeah, really frail. So if you have something like a Star Actor that has like I should use a full restore that has like fly. No, no, like Brave Bird, that'll that'll easily take it out. Alright. Extra sensory is annoying, it can it can flinch you. You should know that. Alright. I think Fire Blast will be a three hit KO. There will be a three hit KO. But it, she might use a full restore with how it brings uh her down. Sludge Bomb's the most powerful move it has. It's like 90 power, but it has same type attack bonus. Okay. Okay, it burned it. That might be bad because now she might use a full restore. And I kind of don't want that. I kind of just want to kill it. The one time a burn, like, I don't want. Alright. Alright. This is getting up to 20 minutes, so I'm going to have to kind of leave it off here and then pick up again. So, yeah.